Today I'm going to do a review on the Beast slash Prince Adam. So it is not two dolls. It is Prince Adam and you can transform him into the Beast here. Is. So let's start with, I guess you can call the Beast. Here is his, a close up of the Beast. It's like a mask you can put over him, but um, that's how you make him into the beast. Um, let's see, here he is, and uh, so that's what you do for. And then here's his coat. Oops. As you can see, it's got the beast's paws and his tail, both sides, and it is the coat, as seen in the movie. Now for Prince Adam, he has, I guess you can say, a light brown hair with a bow in the back. And here's his, his clothes. And it's basically something like a prince would wear, I guess you could say. And he has black boots. Um, let's see. When I got the Beast, or uh, Prince Adam, it was the only one left, so that's why I chose it. I mean, here's what his box looks like. It is it is a bit bigger than the other ones because of the Beast and his coat. Um, but under here, it says Beast. It does not say Prince Adam. Um, here is the back. You can also get Bell, and then here it says the Beast. And I'll read to you what it says on the back. It says, because he did not, let's see, because he did not have love in his heart, a prince was transformed into a terrible beast that the curse can only be broken when his tr he truly learns to love and can earn the love of another. And, oh. I'm sorry, and earn the love of another. All seems hopeless until fate brings Belle to the beast, Beast's castle. And here is Clockwork and a rose. And he was on sale for 10, so I'm very glad about that. Um, so. Yeah, that is my review on Beast or Prince Adam. So, please comment, subscribe, and this is Lucy Bell signing off. Bye-bye.